Um, thank you for coming along and welcome to the Forex Brewery. Um, I guess Forex has got a very proud, um, you know, history with sporting great Australian uh, sporting clubs uh, over the many years and, uh, and we're really excited to announce today obviously the association with the Brisbane Lions. For us the synergy is simple, um, we know uh, Queenslanders, uh, football and supporting AFL and supporting the Lions is a real passion point for, uh, for many fans out there um, and now they can do that and enjoy a Forex Gold uh, while they're doing it. So we hope they come out in droves in the season ahead uh, and support the boys. 2016 saw us relaunch Forex Gold um, with a new campaign called Take In The Gold and for us that's about inspiring people to get out there into the Queensland sun and enjoy time with family and friends and taking in sort of memorable moments and for us um, you know hopefully many people get to do that supporting the Brisbane Lions and really get to take in the gold so um, we really do uh, wish the, the playing group um, the new coach and obviously um, to Greg and his team all the best for the season ahead and we're really excited about the new partnership which we've announced today so that's it from me okay and, and on behalf of the Lions yeah look we've had a great couple of weeks we've had some fantastic announcements with uh, Majestic coming on board as an apparel sponsor our women's team uh, winning their inaugural game on the weekend and then now obviously partnering with 4x and uh, one of you know the iconic Queensland brand so it's been a massive few weeks for the club same as Damien, we're really excited about it. Um, it's on tap now, the Forex at, uh, at the Gabba for all of our home games and, and we just think that's a fantastic partnership for us. So um, as uh, Damien said, it's onwards and upwards in 2017. We've had, as I said, we've had a great couple of weeks. Really looking forward to 2017. Girls have got us off to a good start. Our first uh, game is against the Gold Coast in a couple of weeks. So boys are really fine tuning for that. So, and maybe they can um, have a chat to you about how well the pre-season is going but as I said we're really excited about it and absolutely pumped to have uh, a five-year deal with Forex um, as we go forward so. George what do you think this has taken so long it's uh, an iconic brand and you're an iconic club of Queensland? Not quite sure but I'm uh, wrapped that they've come on board obviously um, as when people come to Queensland they think Forex straight away so to have them um, on board as a part of um, our club now as a sponsor uh, couldn't be more happier. How's it going with the new coaching panel? Yeah fantastic um, obviously Chris Fagan, uh, Jed Adcock and Dale Tappy have come on board um, in the senior department, um, have been fantastic for the, for the playing group, um, fresh faces, new game plan, I think the boys are really relishing it, really looking forward to the season. What's Fagan bring that hasn't been there? Probably just freshness, I think it's just a clean slate for, for all the players. Um, we've totally forgotten about what's happened in previous years and we've just moved forward. He's told everyone not to worry about it. It's a clean slate, restart, let's go again. I mean, it's going to be announced, I gather, in the next couple of weeks. Um, they keep mentioning your name. Yeah, there's been a process that um, Chris is stuck by, um, and it won't be announced until March sometime. So um, we're just going to stick with the process. We've been working extremely hard with leading teams, um, a well-known brand, um, and we're just going to stick with the process, and whatever happens, happens. If you were like a nod, what kind of honour would that be? Oh, tremendous, I would, I would assume. <laughs> Um, being a Queensland boy myself to, to captain such a great club with a great history um, would be a very special honour for myself, yeah, no doubt about that. How involved with that process do you feel you've been? Um, I think it's been a whole, a whole playing group, to be honest. Um, as I said, Chris has given us all a, a nice fresh start. Um, everyone's had the opportunity to put their hand up and come forward. Um, and now it's over to the powers to be to, and the playing group to, to make that decision. Dane Talko should be captain of this club, mate. <laughs> I, I think he's a good fit. Uh, we all know Dane. He's a tremendous player and he's uh, shown what he can do uh, for the club in such a short time. So, look, I mean, if Zorks does get the nod, I think he would be a great fit. I thought the coach is very inclusive of everyone in the club. I mean, do you feel more involved with him there? Uh, yeah, definitely. I think uh, I think a good thing with Fags, he... Uh, He's got a lot to do with the whole playing group, uh, especially the younger guys, making them feel very included. Um, so look, I think Fagg's come from a great place and yeah, I think we're in good stead. How much pressure for this year, I mean, given what's unfolded the last couple of years? Oh, look, as Zork said before, I mean, uh, sort of a clean slate. So uh, yeah, we're not going to put any pressure on ourselves. We're going to see how we go in this, these next couple of practice games and then uh, yeah, just let it roll on from there. You know everyone there yet? You're going to have a lot of new faces, haven't you? Yeah, we do, we do. Uh, we have had a big clean out of our list, but I mean the young talent we've got in is exceptional and I'm looking forward to seeing those younger players grow and yeah, get better better as the season rolls on. Yeah, we're going to stage by 
got the girls either, mate. They've started well. They've started very well. They've started very well. Now it's a great initiative by the club and the AFL to get the women on board. And I mean, uh, yeah, it was awesome seeing the girls get a win on the weekend.